Hi there you guys, I'm Teddy from Bijuteo Beading and in today's tutorial I'm gonna be showing you how to make these long beaded beads earrings with pearls and rondelles. They're easy to make and I'm showing step by step so I'm sure by the end of this tutorial you're gonna be able to make them by yourself. If you don't have so many beads like pearls and rondelles, you could do them only with pearls or only with rondelles and I have a tutorial where I'm showing how and I also have a matching bracelet to this earring. That is why if you like my work, it's a good idea to subscribe and hit the bell because you will be notified when I make matching jewelry to the ones that I have already done, like this bracelet. By the way, if you continue this bracelet, you could make a necklace or if you put a chain here instead of uh, directly the clasp, you could make a really cool necklace, of course. And uh, now I'm making the matching earrings. And down there in description, you will find a full list of materials. If you don't have those materials, you will find where to buy them from. And uh, you could also like, share and comment. And you don't know how much you help me only with this action. And if you make beautiful jewelries following my tutorials, please share them on my Facebook page that I posted below this video. I will be so happy to see your creations. Thank you so much for watching. Now I will start with the list of the materials. Okay guys, so what I'm using for this video are two colors of 11 seed beads. Here I also use 8 beads. These are 8 millimeter pearls and I use six of them. And these are six by eight millimeters rondelt or also called faceted crystals. And these are ear wires and jump rings. I use here monofilament that is 0 0.006 inches, 0 0.15 millimeters. You could use 0 0.14 or 0 0.16 or other beading thread of your choice. And here I use size 10 beading needle scissors. And these are flat nose pliers that I use to attach my ear wires to my work at the end. Okay. Uh, now I'm going to take about three feet of thread on my needle, which is about 90 centimeters. And I'll be back. Okay guys, and I'm back and what I'm going to do is first take one of my pearls or 8 millimeter beads, whatever you have in your stash. Okay, and what I do is that I take 8 black beads. Okay, I have my 8 beads here. And I will go back in circle through this pearl. Okay, now I need eight of these beautiful golden beads. Okay, I have my eight here again. And I'm going back through this pearl and all of the time, guys, I'm holding my tail thread. If you don't hold your tra tail thread, everything will be ruined, okay? Now I have this. And what I do next is really important. I'm going through all of my beads in this direction. Go through as many beads as you can in one movement. Okay. Exiting here. Now I will stick my needle in my mat. And here, what I want to do is make a knot. I'm making it by making a loop going here back through this work and pulling and then I will make one more knot now I have this and I'm going through my pearl and when I go through it and pull my knot hides inside it okay now I'm exiting here and I'm alternating the colors. I have this golden, this black, and now it's time for golden. Okay, I have eight here. And I'm going back in circle through this pearl. Okay. Then black.
and I will continue this four more times, two goldens and two blacks alternated. Okay, and now guys, this is what I have. I have the first ball of my earring ready. And now I'm pulling and what I do next is that I take just one ato. I slide it down. You see I have here four blacks and four goldens, okay? And I'm going back through this pearl again. And now my golden bead goes here. Okay, like this. Now it's time to cut my tail thread. I don't need it anymore. Okay. Okay, now I have the bottom of my earring. And what I want to do next is take one black bead, one ato, okay, this is what I have. Then I take one of my crystals and then I repeat one golden and one ato and one eleven, oh sorry. Okay, this is what I have on my needle. And I slide this down, okay. What I take next is my pearl. Okay, and here guys, I'm taking eight black beads. Okay, I have my eight going back through the pearl. Take eight goldens. Okay, eight. And I go back. And now guys, I'm going to repeat this until I have eight rows in total and I'll be back. This will look like this one. Okay guys, now I have my second beaded ball ready of my earring and you could stop up to here and finish your earring but now I'm going to show you a longer earring okay and I'm taking the same thing that I took before okay this is what I have on my needle 11080 crystal 11080 uh, sorry 80110 8 okay now I have this now I'm going to take another pearl, slide it down, and here, guess what? I'm taking eight beads. Okay, I have my eight here, and I'm going back here through this pearl. Okay, now I will continue and turn this pearl into this one. And I'll be back. Okay, guys, and I'm here where I'm finishing this ball the same way I did before. By the way, I have a whole playlist with beaded balls, and you could check it out when you go on my channel and click on playlists. You will see it, okay? And if you like what I'm doing here, please support me by liking, commenting, and subscribing, of course, with the bell, okay? Now guys, uh, my earring is almost ready, but I need to do one more thing, okay, and this is to add this bit here where I will attach my jump ring and my ear wire, okay, and I'm sliding those beads down, 
okay like this now i'm skipping them not going back through them but going back through this beaded bead okay and i'm pulling then what i do is that i go all the way to the end of my earring and i'm careful because i don't want to miss some bit while i'm doing this okay and i'm going here at the end okay then what i do is that i go back here through this bit back in this direction again but this time what i do is that i find a place and make a knot here okay if you want to reinforce your work you could go back and forth several times but if you do this too many times um, I'm afraid you won't be able to make uh, 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 to make it dangle when you put it on your ear. Okay. So now, what I do is that I make a knot here, and I'm making it by choosing a place between two beads, making a loop, and going once, going second time through the loop you've made make sure i'm between those two beads where i started my knot from and i pull and then i go through the following seed bead and guys it's a good idea to repeat this step with making knot some more times but i'm not showing it here because the tutorial would be too long that is why i'm finishing here and I go through the following seed bead and I cut my thread and never cut next to a knot, always go through the following seed bead. Okay, and now it's time to add my ear wire. I'm taking it here and I'm taking my pliers. And I will open this jump ring. Sometimes I make it with a pair of pliers, with two pliers. But now, I will do it like this because this jump ring is not that hard to open okay and i'm going here through this bit that i put at the end which is larger it is 80 not 11 and now i put my ear wire and what i do is that i squeeze back in the same direction in the same way that i opened it then I make it a little bit closer, okay? And now guys, my earring is ready. Okay guys, and now my beaded bead earrings with pearls and rondelles are ready. So if you like them and you want to see more and more videos like this, it's a good idea to subscribe and hit the bell button to be notified for my new absolutely free upcoming videos for fresh bidding ideas. And in this way, you will be notified when I release matching jewelry to the ones that I have already done, like I did this bracelet and I linked it here at this eye icon. And you will be able to make beautiful sets for presents or for yourself. And down there in the description, you will find a full list of materials, links where you could buy supplies from link to my store and link for PayPal donations to develop this channel. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye from me.